Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. It is Friday, fun yeah. Friday. Are we having fun? No. <laughs> no, because we're still doing school and we're doing chores, finishing up, and then we're headed to the barn. And we have Cookie, and she's going to cry like a sheep again. And we no, have Levi. Every time I turn on the camera, Levi's like, wait, wait for me. <laughs> All right. Yeah, he's turned into a YouTube bird. He's a YouTube bird. No, he just shook his head. No, yeah, he just I'm shook not his head. a YouTuber. <laughs> He's like, anytime there's some action going on, he wants to be involved. Uh, Levi, you're not going to like what's just about to happen. Get their, um, yeah. Uh, no. Yeah, he's like, oh, I wanted that pencil. Look, he's trying to eat the letters on the paper. Oh. I know, he tries to draw and eat letters on paper. Yeah. Like, I want to eat those lines. Don't let him have the edge. No, holy my. This no. is Sophie's writing page. I did mine already. Levi. Hey, Aww. Guys, like. When, it, when he doesn't ever want to get picked up, he will, like, just give you his head. Yeah, like he, you guys, not all birds are affectionate and kind and loving like he will him. kiss your finger. Kiss, kiss. kiss like kiss. some birds are aggressive and mean and like it takes a lot of work to get your bird to be that affectionate and loving towards you. You have to like spend a lot of time with them, bond with them. Like he's come a long way with us. This is Macy's position when I show her um, <laughs> the bird and my horse. Like, None of our pets like our bird. <laughs> Only we like them. Oh, the bird rides Ruby. Yeah. Okay, and the time has come. We have been so busy with the horses and moving barns and all that kind of stuff that we have not had time to clip our dogs now. Yeah, and they're getting and, birds now. and they're getting really long. Yeah, it's your turn too. You're getting your nails clipped too. He's like, I'll just eat it. <laughs> you may know from past videos that they don't love it. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, I'm hiding over here. Like, I'm a stowaway over here. Um, but it has to be done, so let's get it done. <laughs> He's like, woohoo, let's watch! <laughs> yeah! Yay! <laughs> Oh, she's shaking. There were lots of kisses in her. Kiss. What? Let go of it. I
all done. Toby is by far the best out of all the puppies to get their nails done. Um, Macy is by far the worst. Imagine cutting your dog's nails and they have like bird claws. Like their paws are so tiny that if you push too hard, you break their bones. So it's really hard to do them. But um, as long as I just stay calm and persevere, we get them done. Good day for our vlog, we should do a weather report. Yeah, it's pouring rain, freezing cold outside right now, but we are going to the barn. Get our horses out of the rain. Mm -hmm. <laughs> pouring snow yeah it is true we are headed to the barn in the snow Whew. freezing cold actually it's not that cold it's not like horrible but definitely gonna put, be putting them on my mitt so we are gonna go and ride our horses and rescue them out of this horrible weather like this poor Stella is really shivering so she loses some weight today You look good in black and purple. I love that coat. Look how pretty it's though. White. It's so bright. We can take pictures. We could take pictures. I should have brought snow. my phone. I should have brought my camera. The horses are like, what's happening? Stella, come to me. Come on, Stella. Maybe it won't be muddy. Yeah, it probably won't be muddy. It's all crunchy. Stella's looking. We're interesting to her now. Yeah, we're interested. So you're gonna get the gate. Um, Show her the apple. Show her the apple. Storm is what? Storm tech. Okay. This little cutie is not for you. She's coming. She's coming. They're all coming. Come on, Stella. Oh. Get, get. This is it. Across. Oh, it's still muddy. <laughs> Careful. Oh, it's not just muddy. It's wet now. Wet. Oh, crappy. Please, God, don't let me fall. Please. Yes, Please. Me, like so close she's breathing in my ear you're okay you're okay you're okay Sophie you're okay look they're all surrounding me they're all surrounding me get Sophie Sophie you're okay go you have to go 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 grab it Sophie you're fine they're not even paying attention to you go hurry up uh oh. Oh my goodness. They all want in today. Welcome to winter hair. This is the thing. This is what's gonna happen. My hair is like never the best at the best of times. So imagine what winter's gonna be like. But anyway, we're at the barn. Sophie's gonna do a lunch. She doesn't feel like riding today. And we just came like, we have to exercise Stella five days a week. So we came to exercise Stella. Um, most of the time when we come here, they just wanna hang out and be here all day. Today we put the lid on it and we told them it's gonna be a fast day. What's happening? Yeah, they're all out of sorts because of the snow. It's all new and he's wet and they're putting in the horses right now because the weather's kind of getting bad. 
Yeah, so he knows he wants to eat. Like, I love every day we come and the jumps are set up totally different. Like, look how awesome. And then these, I would have loved to have gone over these yesterday. Yeah, who am I kidding? <laughs> Been getting a lot of messages lately about how Stella's not the right horse for us and all that kind of stuff. And I know it does seem like that because she spooked two times and um, she's like a crazy spooker. So when she spooks, they're bad spooks. Even though she doesn't spook very often, they're scary enough. Just once is good for a whole year, a whole lifetime. Um, I just feel like I see so many different things in her than a lot of you guys. Like, she's quiet. She's, like, her ground manners are impeccable. She's not a pushy horse any time, like, ever. She's never, ever pushy. She does have a little bit of attitude occasionally when we ride. But Sophie rides her so well. Like, Sophie rides her better than anybody else in our whole entire family. Sophie can ride her. She rides the way um, a mare needs to be ridden. And Storm's throwing little fits. It's he doesn't want to ride. Oh, he hates to stay still. He was ready to go. Do you guys ever get that feeling though when your adrenaline is pumping and you're at the gym and you're excited and you're about to go and then you just don't get to go? Get going! He heard me. He understands English. Look at how cozy it looks in here though. I can't tell if, I don't think you guys can tell. But it's all white out there and so pretty. He's a bit sassy with the spurs well, we today. Take them off. All right. So Gabby's wearing gray and white today. She looks so pretty when she's soaking wet and all the dirt is dripping off of her. <laughs> she's such a good girl. Wait till you see the video um, of Sophie riding. It was amazing. she's actually small. I feel like she's gonna have a really cute little shape when she gets in shape because oh, when she, she looks like she's actually gonna lose a ton. What? Is he still acting up? Yeah. yeah. Well, she's mad because all the other horses are getting dinner and she's like I'm hungry. Let I know. Eat. I know. It's Hands are actually cold blogging now. So yeah, winter's here. Winter is here. Oh, I'm gonna outside be... when I was catching Stella, my hands were frozen. I couldn't even feel them. I told Mom, you where you're meant. again. Yeah, she's she's scared. She's like, it's winter. I guess that's probably why, winter. Gabby. It's winter. It's all the snow. Oh my God, look at my hair. And his feet could be a little sore too. Yeah, but it's probably because of the snow and the winter. They're all freaked out. For some having Stella in winter. Yep, this is our first winter with Stella, you guys. Isn't it with Storm too? First nope. winter with Storm. Oh yeah, first winter with Storm too. Well, we and we 
Levi. We got him in April. Yeah, we have a lot of firsts this year. I'm a big fan of anything. <laughs> That's code for she's lazy. She's a lazy girl. You're lazy. I'm the one who's running, and you're just walking behind me. It's not fair, Stella. Not fair. If you guys watched yesterday's video, then you saw me tell Stella you're not having this apple because you did not come to us. Yeah, I am not that good at that kind of stuff. She I'm, gave her the apple. Yeah, I gave her the apple. Like, I'm not that kind of mama. She's a nice mama. I waited till we were inside. How she's nice to the horses and mean to us. <laughs> yeah. Like, That's not very fair. <laughs> yeah, you need to be nice and nice. Yeah. Nice and nice. Mean yeah. mean. <laughs> and then mean to Gabby. I'm just mean to anybody who gives me attitude. Me and my honey, we will take you out. crazy when a horse just walks up to you, sticks their head in your armpit. Like, she's just such a love. Cookie does that when I'm working. Like, I need help. I yeah. need help. So, on Equine Devil Advocate Podcast, I know I keep on mentioning it, but it's like become like a staple in our family. Like, we're really into it. The girls and I listen to it during homeschool. And today they asked a question. And the question today that they asked was, does your horse love you and how do you know? Yeah, she loves me because she sticks her head into me. Yeah, like she's cuddly with us. She knows she's we're her cuddly. people. But do you think that means that she loves you? Why do you think yes. she loves you? Um, because I'm kind. I'm not like pushy. Like, get out of my side. Go. I'm like, okay, come snuggle. I'll just stand here all day. So you think she appreciates your gentleness? Yeah. Gabby, do you think your horse loves you? Yeah. How do you know? He does everything for her. He does do everything for her. Clearly Storm is anxious to get to his food. That's why we don't come like a tiny bit before. It's nice to be at a barn where you can't walk two horses in the aisle, eh, at one time? Remember how many times we had to, like, back horses up? Now I can just turn them around. The only reason we don't canter Stella right now is because she's out of shape. So it'll be just like, you know, you trying to run a marathon. But she can canter. Definitely. That one's pretty. It's not too bad. Oh, I love that little one. Look at that little one. Two hundred forty-nine dollars. No, that's not. How much is it? How much? Well, that's not too bad. Oh, and. Ooh. I like this one. Yeah. I like that one. I like this one. I like that one. Oh my god. Stop. We're getting this. <laughs> yeah, it's too skinny. Not that one. We're not everybody ready. go. Everybody go stand by the tree that you like the best. What else? Out of all the trees, go.
go stand by the tree that you like. I like that one too. All right, so it is between this tree and this tree. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.